Do you use Google Docs daily and find yourself sticking to using the same familiar features and menu items over and over again? Did you know that Google constantly updates and adds new functionality? Today, I'm excited to show you some of those recent Google Docs features that can significantly streamline your work and transform Google Docs into much more than just a document. In the comments, I'd love to hear what features you wish Google Docs had or which new ones you've already discovered and enjoy using. By the way, have you tried Google Docs tabs yet? Be sure to stick around until the end to discover how you can easily master all the best Google apps, tips, and tricks. Here I have a blank Google Doc ready to go. Let's look at the insert menu. You'll see some familiar options here, but there are a number of new ones as well, including building blocks, smart chips, and e-signature fields. This video will highlight three of my favorite building blocks, and I'll explain smart chips and e-signature fields in other videos. Under building blocks, you'll see a variety of pre-designed content sections that you can easily insert into your document. My three favorite building blocks are email draft, calendar event draft, and task tracker. I love these specifically because they are each integrated with Gmail, Calendar, and Google Tasks, respectively, which gives you even more tools to manage a whole project from within a Google Doc. Email drafts. I'll show you email drafts first. In my new volunteer role, I send out a variety of weekly and monthly emails that are almost the same every time. They need to go to the same people and have the same text, but with a few different links. So by creating a Google Doc with all of my weekly and monthly email drafts, I can keep my emails consistent, not forget any recipients, update the links as needed, and click one button to send the email as soon as I'm ready. This not only saves time, but also my brain power, so I can use it for more complicated and less routine tasks. What will you use this email draft building block for? Calendar event draft. If you've watched my other videos about calendar events, you know that I think of each event as a container. And my goal is to have as many details and files included in the each event as possible so that everyone has what they need for that event. Therefore, if I am just starting to collect my thoughts about a big meeting or a team member and I are already collaborating on a project in a document and need to plan a related upcoming meeting, I can use this calendar event draft inside of my Google Doc to collect as many details as possible and collaborate with my colleague. Then when we're ready, we can click one button to add it to our calendar and invite everybody to the event all at once. Task Tracker. And now for another one of my favorite building blocks, Task Tracker. Did you know that Google Tasks is part of Google Workspace? and has its own separate Google Calendar, it is integrated with Google Docs, and has a synced standalone phone app too? Hint, if this is news to you, check out my quick Google Tasks class to give you a great start on how you can manage your tasks within Google Workspace. With all of that in mind, the new task tracker inside of a Google Doc table is an added bonus and a game changer. Inside of this cute little table, you can list project tasks, assign them to people, and give them due dates. Then with one click, you can immediately add all of these tasks to each person's individual task list, which then appears on their own calendar and their Google Tasks phone app as well. As soon as they're done with the task and mark it complete in their task list, this Google Doc task tracker will immediately be updated. So everyone with access to this doc knows what has been completed at all times. What will you use this task tracker for first? To recap, my three favorite new building blocks are email draft, calendar event draft, and task tracker. They can each be used inside of a Google doc, but they integrate with one click to either Gmail, calendar, or Google tasks and ensure that you can manage a project or a part of one within a Google Doc. As you can see, these new features are designed to make your workflows more efficient and productive. 
In the comments below, let me know which building block you plan to try first and what you will use it for. I love it when you share innovative ways that you are using Google features so that others can learn from you too. If you would benefit from mastering all of your Google apps with confidence, click the link below to register for Google Groupies. This valuable membership gives you access to a three-month membership, self-paced online classes, including Gmail, Calendar, Drive, Docs, Sheets, Slides, Meet, and Tasks, plus a bi-weekly 30-minute live group Q&A session, online and live access to me, and a membership in a like-minded community for networking and shared learning. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more Google Apps tips and tutorials. And be sure to share this video with others who would find it helpful too. I look forward to helping you succeed.